I mean, we, we obviously see uh, some great things from them, and uh, we do a lot of great things too. But, I mean, at the end of the day, it's football. You got to put the ball down and just be ready to play at the end of the day. What do you see from your offense? You know, I mean, obviously you guys move the ball a lot better on offense. That's going to mm-hmm. take the pressure off you defensively a little bit. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean, knowing that uh, they're, you know, carrying their weight as well. Uh, I, I would say that they're starting to find uh, what they need on offense and uh, getting the ball to the right guys and uh, spreading it. So I mean, it's it's great for them, but I would I would like to see a lot from every every special team, every offensive play, every defensive play, because at the end of the day, we got to play together as a team and do everything that we can to win the game. Marcus, you played at the highest level. Um, how would you kind of compare where you played in, in you know Missouri Valley Conference? Uh, it, it's really not that much different. Uh, I would say because I would say in this league, you got to actually work for a win in this league. And I would say, like, literally every every time you play a game, you got to work for a win. Because every time we play in the game, we, we would think that we're going to win the game. And the next thing you know, things happen. So it's it's football. It's a game of up and downs. And you just got to be willing to win it more than the other team. They kind of send Hendricks all over the field in the past game. Just how do you kind of game plan around that and slow them down? Just track them and get the ball down. That's all we need to do is make good tackles. How would you kind of classify this game? All football games are a game that I would love to win. So, I mean, I'm looking at it as every single game that I play, I want to do the best that I can, and I'm sure my teammates do too. So, we're just hoping to get the win in the end. I think their backup quarterback played last week has been injured to the starter. Are you prepared for one or the other or both? Just what's going on there? Whoever's on the depth chart, we got to prepare for it at the end of the day because you never know what could happen. So, uh, we're trying to – we're kind of just looking into both. It really doesn't matter at the end of the day. They both play – they both – they both play quarterback, so we just got to do our jobs at the end of the day. Does that change anything for you, like preparation, or do you just prepare the same? Uh, it's just the same preparation every week, day in, day out. We're just looking into seeing what's on their depth chart, seeing who brings what to the table, and uh, just kind of adapting to it and hopefully just making good plays at the end of the day.